Do you have financial questions about your present, your future? Well, as most people do, I do too. And here's a person to talk to about those questions, Art Cambridge with Art Cambridge Financial. Good to see you again. Good morning. Let's talk once again a little bit about Medicare. Now, we, we, we talked about supplements and things like that just a little bit before. I, I, there's another phrase out there, Medicare Advantage. Can you explain what that is you know, so that it takes some of the questions out of it? Well, it's a, uh, when the government designed this a number of years ago, uh, it, they, a Medicare Advantage basically takes over for Medicare. You're still in the Medicare system. However, your health care is administered by an insurance company. And as of 24, things were pretty rosy. So there weren't a lot of changes in the Medicare Advantage arena. Mm -hmm. However, the latter part of 23, there were an abnormal amount of claims came in for a lot of the major Medicare Advantage companies. So in 25, I believe you're going to see a lot of changes. We've had one company actually sold all of their Medicare Advantage in Part D because they're going to get out of the Medicare Advantage business mm -hmm. and also the Medicare supplement business. Uh, and when these were designed, uh, here in, in the Springfield area, uh, most people don't pay a premium for a Medicare Advantage plan. All right. Uh, however, they have co-pays for everything that they go do. And they'll have a maximum out of pocket where Medicare itself does not have a maximum out of pocket. And the government uh, said that these plans have to pay as well as Medicare. Well, that should be your first red flag. Medicare doesn't pay 100% of your bill. No, no, no. So you're going to be responsible for certain amounts. And the key word is what, it, what your maximum out of pocket could be. Are, are, are these Advantage plans, are they one size fits all or are they kind of, uh, you know, they may be a little more individually specific? Well, they are to a certain extent. There might be a half a dozen different plans for different insurance companies, and you, you kind of have to fit it to the client, okay. uh, whether he's a veteran, not a veteran, what the zip code is, whether they want prescription drugs tied to it, or they want, don't want prescription drugs tied to it because they get their drugs from the VA, all sorts of different things involved there. And, and that's what you talk to the client about. And of course, that's why a client speaks to a financial advisor. And if you have questions about Medicare, about supplements, about uh, the advantage, all sorts of things, it's easiest to come to an expert. And you know, Art Cambridge is a person who knows what he's talking about when it comes to this. So give him a call, come and see him, and you won't regret it.